Okay guys, so I'm going to do a uh, deliver with me video today. Um, I'm only using one phone, so I don't have my mom's phone with me. So I will try my best um, to just use my phone and um, like let you guys know what I got. I won't be able to like show the screen unless I take a screenshot. Maybe that's what I'll do is like take a screenshot after each order that I accept or something. Um, we'll see how it goes, but yeah, um, it's like 5.15, so I'm starting a little late today, um, but I will let you guys know what I got. Okay, hey guys, I got my first DoorDash order. It's actually a double, going nine miles for $12, but it's for two orders, so I just accepted it just to get me started. I was getting nothing but like really low-ball offers before, and like everything was like really, really low. So I decided to get this one, um, two orders for $12 going nine miles from Chipotle. So that'll be my first two orders of the day, DoorDash. So I'll let you guys know when I get the order and when I do drop it off. Okay. Okay guys, so I just picked up both orders from Chipotle. Um, they were already ready when I got in there, which was cool. So now I'm going to go and drop them off, listening to Hair Nation. Um, I think Eddie Trunk is doing his radio show today. I'm not sure. I just turned it on. But yeah, so I will show you guys when I get to the first drop off. It's two orders. And I think the first one is like seven or eight miles away. So I'll show you guys when I get there. Okay, guys, I'm here at the first uh, house for the customer, Benny. That's a cute name, Benny. Um, it's, it is a leave it door, so I'm just going to grab it and leave it at the door and ring the bell. I do have her name on a post-it note here. So she only had one item. Okay. Sure it's the right one. Yeah, it says bunny on there. That's it. Okay guys, I just dropped off Benny's order. Let's get to the next one. I'll let you guys know when I get there. Okay guys, I'm at the second house. I'm gonna deliver it here. And then I am going to leave it on the chair and ring the bell. Okay, so I just left it there and I rang the bell. And I will let you guys know what I get next. Okay. Okay guys, I just accepted a Grubhub order for $10 going two and a half miles. Um, it's at a Mexican restaurant and it says to use your Uber, no I'm sorry, your Grubhub card to pay for it. So I'm going to try it. Um, I do have a Grubhub card. Um, I haven't, like, I don't use it a lot, but I do have one. Um, and I have used it before to pay for orders, but I don't do them very often at all. I rarely do those orders, but since it was a short distance, like two and a half miles for 10 bucks, I thought I would give it a try and let's see how this goes. Um, hopefully, hopefully everything works out okay where the car does work, but, um, I'll let you guys know what happens when I get to the restaurant That's and when I get the order. Okay. Alright guys, I'm here. I actually, I thought that this was like a drive through restaurant where I could just go in the drive through and pick up the order. <laughs> um, it's really not and I don't really want to go in there in case the car doesn't work. Um, so I am going to reassign this order. I feel bad, but I just don't want to go in the restaurant with this card to pay for it and it a chance of it not working and not being able to leave a tip it's just like I don't know it's kind of like 
I don't want to go through all that because I wish I could leave a tip, but I can't, you know? So I'm just going to reassign this Grubhub order and see what I get next. Um, hopefully, you know, I'm sure I'll get something else. But yeah, so that's what's up. I just wanted to let you guys know what I'm going to do. Okay. Hi guys, so I just accepted an Uber Eats order. Um, I think it was $11 going six miles. Um, it's one order. Um, it's from this Asian restaurant and right before this order, they sent me two for like $19, but it was a 19 miles total for $19. So I just thought that was kind of far for the payout. And then they came back and just sent me one. So I'm wondering if they just sent me one of the two that they had tried to get me to do two before. So anyways, this is better. I think it's going six miles for, I want to say $11. I think that's what it was um so yeah i'll let you guys know when i uh, get the order i'm like half a mile away from the restaurant and i'll just let you guys know when i get it okay okay guys i got the order they have a tea right here it's like a thai tea and then i put the bag in the back and yeah she's only five and a half miles away and i will show you guys when i get to the drop off okay okay guys i'm here at this house this is where i'm going to drop off the order and it is a leave it door so um just gonna put the note on there ring the bell and leave it at the door Okay, so here's the bag right here. I just want to, I want to put it like where it won't go out. Kind of put it like that. Hopefully it'll stay. Oh, you guys, I have to bring the drink, too. I left the drink in the car, so I'm going to go get it. I'm glad I remembered it. But her tea is in here, too. So I'm glad that I didn't just, like, take off with the tea, you know? Okay, so I got the tea as well. Lauren, I have your tea too. Okay. So I left the tea there as well. Hi, Lauren. Hi. There's your tea. Yeah, I, I just remembered it. I'm like, oh shoot, I forgot her tea. Okay, bye. Bye bye. <laughs> okay. I will show you guys what I get next. Okay guys, I just accepted an order from McDonald's for $8 going six miles. I just accepted it because like, you know, it's a decent order, the amount, and plus it's like going back towards my area. So, um, and I'm really familiar with that McDonald's. So yeah, I just accepted it and I'm about like three miles away anyway. So it's probably only like maybe three to four miles from the restaurant probably but um yeah so I will get this order from McDonald's it's an Uber Eats order and I will show you guys when I get it and when I drop it off all right all right guys um, I got here to McDonald's and it seems like the order was already picked up so what I'm gonna do is I think Uber will pay me like half pay or something um, I'm going to call him and tell him that the order was picked up. And, um, yeah, so that's what I'm going to do just so I can get paid for, like, coming here. Um, I guess that happens sometimes. It doesn't happen a lot, but it happens, like, every now and then. So, <laughs> yeah, um, that's what I'm going to do. So hopefully I get another order, but I'm going to call him maybe get three or four dollars whatever they give me for coming and that's it okay 
Okay guys, so I just got off the phone with Uber Support and they credited my account $3 um, for attempting to pick up the McDonald's order um, that was already picked up. I'm in front of Potbelly Sandwich Shop and Mod Pizza now. Hopefully I get something, but I'm just gonna stay here and for a few minutes and if I don't get anything, I'll just like go to another location. But yeah, I'm gonna try to do a couple of more orders and I will let you guys know what I got, okay. Okay guys, so I got a double order going to Potbelly and then a Sea Island Shrimp House. It was $15 for 10 miles, so that's like $7.50 an order, but $15 for 10 miles isn't bad. It's a double delivery, so I'm going to wait at Potbelly a few minutes and give them time like to get it ready. It's a small order, but you know, I just got it. So, um, so yeah, I'm going to pick that up here and then go to Sea Island, which is in the same shopping center, just like a little bit down. And, um, last time I went to Sea Island, I waited about 15 or 10 or 15 minutes. Um, hopefully, you know, I won't have to wait as long, but who knows? Like they do bring it out to the car though. I think it's like curbside there so that's cool okay guys so i will let you guys know when i get the orders and when i drop them off all right mm -hmm. okay guys awesome i'm just leaving the sea island shrimp house and i didn't really have to wait because the girl just came out to me before i could even like check in and um it was already ready so i'm gonna be delivering the pot belly order first and then um i'm gonna deliver this one second so yeah, so I'm going to um, go to the Potbelly. Turn left onto Agora Parkway. Then <laughs> turn left onto Form Access B. The Potbelly sandwich order uh, will be first, and then I'll deliver that one. And I'll let you guys know when I get there and when I drop it off. All right, All right guys, I'm here. Um, I'm going to deliver the Potbelly order first, and it's a leave it door. Um, so I'm just going to get it out of here. It is so dark on this street, like super dark. Um, but yeah, the pot belly is up in the back. And then I got my other order in the front seat. So there we go for Kristen. Okay guys, now on to the next order. I will show you guys when I get there. Okay guys, so I'm almost at the house of this customer. He wants me to hand it to him, so um, I probably won't bring my phone up there, but he just said to ring the bell and then- Arrive at 236 Jersey Bend. Arrived. Okay, I'm here, and I'll let you guys know if I decide to do another one. Another order. Okay. Okay, so I handed her the order, and look, she has the same car as mine, except hers is gray or silver, and mine is red. But I was telling her that my car looked just like hers, but a different color. But she says hers was a 19. I told her mine's a year younger, like 2020, but they look like, the model looks almost the same. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I might try to do another order guys. I'm not sure if I get a good one. I'll let you guys know, but I don't know yet. We'll see what happens. I'll let you guys know if I decide to do another one. Okay. Okay guys, I just wanted to let you guys know I had on my apps for a little bit, but all I'm getting, and this is the majority of the orders today have been low ball offers, like really high miles for a low payout. Like, I think I only did one, two, three, four orders today. Now, granted, I did start a little bit later, but I worked for like almost three hours and only did, I'm thinking, let me see, I did three with DoorDash and one with Uber. No GrubHub, so yeah, that's only like four. Um, so yeah, it just, I think after all is said and done, I made about 
40 bucks today. But yeah, I mean, some days, and it's a Monday, it's slow. So not every day you're gonna make like 50 to 60 bucks, you know? My goal is usually always at least, I would say at least 60. But because today I did start like an hour later than usual, I'm just gonna call it a night and it's so dark out here. So I'm gonna go home. And thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, all that. And take care guys. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Go